we got our brand new five frame nuke. We're gonna install it in our hive. We got our smoker going, we got our frame set up. What's different about a nuke compared to just a bee package is that the queen and some of the colony are already in there. They're already laying brood. So we're really just moving the frames from this temporary box into our hive and the queen and everything else are going to take off right along with it. So it's kind of a quick, easy way to get them all back in there. We've never placed a nuke in our hive before, so this is something new for me. Usually I'm doing a, a three pound package and just dumping the bees in along with the queen and her cage, so it's a little different for me this year. And take a look at all of our bees to see how they look. They all seem very healthy in there at the moment. So everything's looking pretty good. I do not see the queen up on top, which you normally would not anyways. Slowly pick that baby up. Okay, I do not see a queen on there. There's some honey in there. I see a lot of pollen in there. Okay. A few darker drones walking around on top. Let's see what's on the other side here. You can see the honey up there in the corners. See the bees pretty busy. So we're going to drop this frame in. It's a good looking honey frame. Okay, we're going to hold this over the top of our hive in case the queen is on there. She would fall out. That's, I don't know. That could possibly, I don't think that's her. Looking around. These are some bigger ones, but I don't see the queen. Which is not unusual. Sometimes you just don't see her. I'll flip this over. Check out this side. It's a larger bee, but I think it's a drone. I do not see the queen on any of these. Nope. I see lots of honey though, so that's good. We're going to drop this one in next to the other one. We're going to take this empty frame and put it in the middle so that the bees will fill this frame and be less likely to swarm. It's a little weird, but that's what he suggested. So we're going to put that one in. Put that in the middle because the bees tend to congregate in the middle. In our next frame, again we're going to hold that over our hive. Kind of look quickly, see if we can find the queen in there anywhere. And I do not see her. Flip this real quick. darker, a little lighter brown. Still not seeing her anywhere. Nope. So I'm going to drop this one in carefully. Okay, we're going to lift this up. And I do not see the queen on there either. On the side very quickly. seeing her. Drop this one in. Alright, so we've got all the bees placed in there. I did not see the queen, but we're going to assume she's in there. Uh, hopefully everything's going to be okay. We're going to drop the lid on this. 
and let the bees go back to what they're doing. There's the rest of them all in here. Don't know, there's a larger, a couple of larger bees down there in the corner. Hopefully that's not the queen. Just gonna shake that one off a little bit and dump them all in. Try and get them to go down. Okay, we're just scraping some of the excess wax off of there so we can close the lid. Okay. And it looks like we're pretty much ready to let them go back in their happy home. Well, if the bees go back inside of their hive, it's an indication that the queen is in there. So hopefully they're going to find their way in. You can check this box. Make sure that she isn't in here. I do not see her. I see lots of other smaller bees. I want the bees to go back inside the hive. That's where your queen will be. Okay, there's one going in. That's good. Like I said, you, you do want the bees to go back inside the hive, which is an indication the queen's in there and they'll find their way in. So hopefully that's where they're all headed. We'll wait and see. That's it. We'll check on our nuke in a while. We have some sugar water for them to feed on right away. Uh, hopefully that will keep them happy. We'll leave this box out here so they can exit from the box and go inside the hive. And the weather's nice. The sun's out. Hopefully they'll start to find some flowers right away and everything will be good. That is our new beehive for 2020.